Okay, another Dollar Tree product, Imperial Garden Lobster Egg Roll, microwavable product of USA? Keep frozen, sauce packet included, fully cooked, just heat and serve. I'm particularly interest, interested in the ingredients. Let's try to keep my finger out of the way. I'm doing this without a tripod because uh, I want to make my life more exciting and interesting. All right, so we find out that the main ingredient, which is at the top there, is cabbage, crab flakes. And we find out that surimi is a fish paste of pollock and or golden thread fin. That sounds so nice. Oh, wait, golden thread fin beam. Wow, that's, that's interesting. There is lobster meat and salt, celery, blah, blah. But the real goodies are 2% of a seasoning, uh, mono ammonium glutamate. I heard of MSG as a flavor enhancer, but not the mono ammonium. A little garlic. Then we got the all purpose, all famous, all friendly disodium stuff. Inositate, disodium guanolate, little yeast extract. And we got some other modified stuff, cellulose gum, gum sodium propone, pro, propone, no, propionate, dyslexia kicking in, fumaric acid, I, I love fumaric acid, I always want that, you know, fumaric acid, we got some other stuff, sodium bicarbonate, there it is, you got the uh, antidote, right mixed in there, sodium aluminum, I always want some more aluminum in my diet. I have an aluminum, uh, I think, uh, deficit or deficiency. Then another monocalcium phosphate. Okay, this is stuff is probably in a lot of things that we eat. Uh, we got some enrichment, potassium this. Okay, big deal. The really thing I'm, I'm also interested in, and my voice is starting to go up, <clears throat> is, um, look, we have vitamin C. That's good. Ascorbic acid, vitamin C, you need that. But I like the Thermflow. Thermflow, food starch modified. I really want Thermflow. I never had some of that. And we got the um, oh, allergens alert. Okay. Crustaceans, yeah, selfish, be, shellfish, be careful. All right, but that Thermflow, I'm looking forward to that. All right, you can heat it all different ways, you know, conventional, blah, blah, but I'm going for the easy, the easy under. Microwave that. That's right. Probably won't be as crispy, but it'll save my life some time. Like, uh, it'll save you some lifetime by not watching the rest of this video. All right, <laughs> not making a suggestion, but it's too late now. Come on, stick with me. Let's see. Okay, definitely. I blasted this egg roll, lobster egg roll. I blasted it. I wanted to go above the 165 or even 180. Um, it was more than 90 seconds. It was maybe two and a half minutes. Okay, 270 calories, some fat, saturated, a little bit, no trans, cholesterol 16, MG, sodium, a nice hit of almost 540 milligrams, protein, 9.5 protein, wow, that's interesting, no vitamin D, some nice calcium, a little bit, a little iron, potassium, based on a 2,000 calorie diet. Look at that, it's starting to let out some nice grease. Let's zoom in on that. Yeah, wow, I didn't even realize. Look at the grease dripping. You know this is gonna be a nice grease bomb. Look at that. But you know, most egg rolls are, they just uh, deep fry these babies. But let's see, this is to be expected. All right, I'm not gonna bother with any niceties and I'm not gonna get my bleached glove all uh, greased up. Let's just go right through it. Whoa, look at the remnants there. Wow, it's hot. Mm, 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 okay. All right. There we go. Mm. All right. Um, it's nice and hot. <laughs> it's, um, took on my mouth full again. But I'm not on camera, so it's okay. It's, um, mm, excellent. It's nice and cabbagey. Just like the uh, Chinese restaurants, which is, uh, I think, okay. You're expecting a nice little grease. And uh, I'm just moving this plate so you see the 
little bay. Uh, it tastes pretty darn good. It tastes a little bit of lobster, mainly cabbage and whatever else there's stuff in this thing with. Let's see. Looks like some veggies. Hmm. It's not tasty. Oh, look at that. That looks pretty good, actually. Hold on. Mm -hmm. Um, mmm. Wow. Alright, very tasty. Very salty. But I think I can taste that sodium disuflate and the therm flow and whatever else. I'm actually not going to use the therm flow because it, it has a sauce. But, uh,. Uh, you know what? Maybe I will. You see, I'm going random. All right, bear with me. There's the uh, therm flow. <laughs> and look, it's flowing nice and thermy. It looks like duck sauce. I'm going to dip this in. Stuff is falling out of it. And let's try this out. There you go. It's got some therm flow on it. Just duck sauce. With therm flow. You know something? For a dollar? In a weird way, I'm gonna say it's good. I mean, because it tastes like a Chinese uh, egg roll. Like from almost, I think, from a restaurant. I think it does. Of course, I don't know what it's gonna do to my system. Probably the same thing most of these things do to my system. So I'm gonna say good with the expectation that it has all the benefits and lack of benefits that a deep fried lobster. Uh, egg roll would have so I don't know paradoxically I, I guess I'm gonna say it's good wow talk about a random uh, observation I mean random decision here but yeah all right okay there you go lobster egg roll Jeff goes random <laughs>